Hello. So I wanted to come on and share what I use on my face. So I have very sensitive skin. I only can use Safeguard soap. So uh, this was the only type of soap that I also could use on my face. So I would typically uh, wash my face with Safeguard. And once I rinse that off, I would use, my cousin told me about this, witch hazel and it's used 100% natural and uh, it's for your face and your body and um, gentle relief for oily, irritated, red, damaged, blemished, or inflamed skin. And so I was telling her about like I had real, real, real dark bags. I still have them, but they have cleared a lot. I've been using this um, for about over almost two years now. And so it has improved a lot. It used to be so dark right here. And so she was telling me that it lightens your skin up. And so I was like, well, I don't want my skin light. And she was like, I think it gives it the original, the original tone. And so I was like, cool, I will use it for the bags area. So what I would do is get one of these because I've already did it. Use this, go over my face, go especially go right here. And then whatever little spots you have, so I would do this, go all the way around. So I would do this usually at night, but I did it this morning as well. And so I would also use tea tree oil. Now this, I put this on after I do the face wash and in the morning time. Most of the time, I'm not going to have on makeup every day. This is usually what I put on. Some tea tree oil. And if I want a little shine, I would probably put a dab of this with the tea tree oil. And I'll mix it. Make sure you can see it. I'll mix it all in. And that's usually what I put on. I don't have on the foundation all the time. But... I wanted to talk about some of the benefits of the tea tree oil. Um, I use it as the face remedy. Uh, it's traditionally like a medicine. It was used for, um, I'm trying to think of them, to treat um, respiratory problems, cuts and scrapes, uh, burns. Uh, it kills certain strains of bacteria. Um, it fights acne. Spice. Gets rid of nail fungus. Uh, it soothes and heals the skin from inflation, from rashes, and ringworms. You know, like when the kids they'll come home from school with ringworms, it heals that as well. So this is what. Once I found out all the benefits, actually, you probably want to uh, look up the benefits of tea tree oil. I'm sure there's more. Because I, I think it heals athlete, athletic foot, athletic foot, athlete's foot, however it is. But it heals that as well. So you probably want to look up the benefits of tea tree oil. But it actually works because uh, I don't have any bumps on my face. Uh, of course, you're going to get some. Like, say, for instance, if I go and get a face wax or something like that, I may get a bump or something. But I, when I put this on, it heals it. So... It's definitely a good little regimen you would want to use and try out. A lot of people were asking me one time I put that I put tea tree oil on my face and they were asking me what were the benefits and I didn't have enough room to just, um, well, I didn't want to write a long post on Instagram sharing all the benefits. So I told them that I would uh, do a video on it. So that's what it is. Oh. With this, you do not have to put a lot on. Like, say, for instance, I probably put, that's enough, two drops. And I just put it all over my face. And it gives it a shine. Feels good. And that is it. That's all that I use on my face. You tell the difference, it's a little shine. But that is it. Bye bye.